second of three to start the week. Hey everybody, welcome back to some more Tug Dick. The Tug Dick in this LP there is. How are you all doing? I'm excited to be playing more baseball because I love this game. Tug Dick is leading off. I like that with his combination of speed and contact. That's a good spot in the lineup for him. And then briefly, let's take a look at the two starting pitchers who get the assignment here. Yeah, Tim Hudson. I... Well, he's only pitched one game so far. His ERA will come down. This early in the year, ERAs can be deceptively high or low. Bow, bow. Oh, some early action in the outfield. That doesn't bode well. <laughs> I'm guessing he's not played much yet this year. That he has exactly zero for his average. Or he's a giant wiener loser. Yeah, do you hear that? Tug Dick told you that you're a loser. It's okay. And you're out, sir. Yeah, you better run back to first. Or I'll come over there and slap you in your face. And this is one of those guys that throws what you call a heavy sinker. Normally he's going to get a lot of ground balls. Yeah, how you all like that, fans? Tug Dick and it, dicking it up. He's actually doing pretty well so far. I might have just jinxed his, uh, his, you know, major league career, but so far the transition hasn't been too bad to the majors. The fact that he's such a free swinger it might come back to haunt him a little bit here in the leadoff spot, though. See, man, oh, this guy's got a ton of pitches. I'm a fan of that. Yeah, that was way low. Well, he's a rookie. It's his rookie season at the majors. He gets nerves. Ah, balls. Go to the stands. Wait, one of the fans throw it back? That's your souvenir. It's a dick in the air. Oh, I should not have swung at that. Talk about a bad at bat. He's a little too excited. He was like, I'm going to show all the ladies, and they're going to want some tug dick action. They're like, you just kind of flail, honey. Shut up. Charlie Blackman will What's up, Charlie? Off here as it'll be How's your chocolate factory? I heard it got bought out by Hershey's, and all your Oompa Loompas got laid off. Now, the old now they're homeless. You're out. <laughs> I don't know what that's all about. Tick Tick probably enjoyed some Charlie the Chocolate Factory last night, so. Man, Tim Hudson's certainly letting people uh, hit the ball off of him. It'd be nice if our Giants could get the giant score going on early on. I forgot to look at what our record is. Our record's pretty good, isn't it? Well, at least nobody else on the team has been hitting uh, this guy so far. Oh, screw you, shortstop! Safe! Yeah, thank God Tug Dick's got some speed. That's one fast dick. Well, the shortstop didn't do anything. If he would have charged it, I don't know. It would have depended on the transition. If he would have charged it, he might have been able to throw Tug Dick out, but he just sat there. I think Gregor was about to have diarrhea. He's like, oh, I'm not good. No. Bottom of the third. Would have been bottom of the third if he would have diarrhea there. That would have been gross. I hope you're not eating food as you're watching this. Man, that guy's got a high leg kick. We're going to take a risk and see if we can go on him. Well, that is a late start. Safe. How you like that? Tug Dick can steal on you, bro. Now, we're playing National League style ball. Why don't you guys bunt Tug Dick to third? Come on, dude, bunt him to third and then get him home, get that early run. Wow. We're scared of Tug Dick going again. The fans are 
mildly entertained. They're like, let's go, Giants. Aw, oh, come on, dickweed! If I wanted to watch someone swing and miss, I would have asked my grandma to come up to the plate. Oh. Yeah, you better be scared of Tug Dick, bro. This dick will destroy you. That's what I told your mom last night. She was like, bring it on, and I did. Now she's in the hospital. How do you feel about that, picture? Swing and a miss on a ball in the dirt as they'll need to throw down to first. I would have realized he's in the dirt, I would have gone to the third. Oh. Way to strike out, dip. Shit. Hey, Hunter Pence. Hunter. It's Pence, not the Here we go, guys, let's go. Alright, your pitch coming right here, right now. Runner! Oh, shit! Ah! And he is out. Screw you! I thought he was going towards home. I should have been just a little more hesitant. Rookie mistake there. He's trying to be aggressive, but gets a little too over anxious. Yeah. They step off and nail him. I hate that pitcher. Damn you, Franklin Morales. You have no Morales. You're going to hell. <laughs> it's probably inappropriate to say to the gentleman. He didn't do anything. Did throw Tug Dick out, though, for getting too far off the base. Alright, guy on second, one out. The pitcher did a good job advancing the runner from first to second. So really, we just need to do the same thing. Get the guy over to third. We'll play nationally. We might actually try and throw down a bunt. Well, it didn't get me. I thought I was going to be able to get a little closer, but we did advance the runner to third. Well, I was hoping it'd be a little better bunt. Maybe I should put some points in the bunt. I did it at all in the first season because I think we played with a DH in all the minor league teams. So there's no real reason for us to bunt hardly ever. Ah, nobody got him home. I guess he should have swung away. He was having a hard time hitting so far today, though. I say that, but he was one for one. No, don't don't let these... No, bad Rockies. Runners in the corner is two out. Except Drew Stubbs. Can I exchange enough of you for some, like, I don't know, markers or something like a Chuck E. Cheese? Yeah, that's been a long time coming. They haven't done anything with their opportunities so far. Maybe this will be the time that they finally try to score uh oh, that's gonna bring in a run, possibly. Oh, good catch! You're my hero. Should I sing for you? Did you ever know that you're Dick's hero? Hey, why aren't there more people in the upper deck? Take me out to the ball game. Buy me some peanuts. And, I mean, peanuts and crapper, crapper jack. Ugh, I'm having a hard time using words. <laughs> All right, Richie. Richie Nunez will stand in. He reached on an error last time through. Hmm, are you related to that kid from Malcolm in the Middle? The one-one now from Hudson, and he gets under this one a bit as this is lifted into center field. Thank God, Tug Dick is fast, keeping that game tied. And there are two away now. That's I think we expected to see a well no, game coming in, and we got one. Yeah, go Tim Hudson, man. Still got some gas in the tank, apparently. Quit being snooty, manager. Quit holding your nose up. All right, Tug Dick leading off the bottom of the eighth. One for three. That bunt didn't work out as well as I hoped last time. It wasn't a very good bunt, and more importantly, nobody scored after we advanced the runner. Come on, rookie, settle down. Think about. Oh, fuck your curveball. That was so slow. Wow, you trying to hit him in the head? Tug dick. Go charge the mound. I'm going to mount you, pitcher, like I mounted your mom last night. She liked it. 
Tug Dick says nice things like that to the pitcher all the time. Oh, curveball again. So slow in that movement. I struck out with your mom too. Oh wait, maybe that's not trash talking. Damn it, Franklin. You're not nice like that turtle named Franklin. Our team's having a hard time scoring. Both teams are actually here. Oh no, this is not good. Okay, we need one more out or we lose. We just lost the game in the bottom of the... Oh wait, this is top of the ninth. All right, come on guys, bottom of the ninth. Let's tie it up or let's lose two to zero. Well, that was a bunch of crap. It's at and Park. Can I call home and tell my... Oh, manager, don't throw... show me your crotch. I was one for four. I tried to help with the bunt. He's like, well, I don't know if that's the best time to bunt. I'm like, you're a bunt. Yeah, you can't win if you can't score, so there's probably not a whole lot of debate about who take home top player of the game honors in this one. Yeah, Franklin pitched very well. I feel bad for Tim Hudson. He pitched very well, too. That sucks if you pitch um, a shutout through eight or whatever and the team doesn't get any runs to support you. Oh, did they have to show the clip of... Wait, was that Tug Dick striking out? I forget Tug Dick's number. That guy pitched a complete game shutout. I like the single with a stolen base. I don't like the two strikeouts. If I was like Tug Dick's manager, I'd be like, more of the one, less of the others. Tug Dick's probably like, nobody else scored either. <laughs> Alright, let's play Colorado again. We've lost both games against Colorado. And we're coming in as a pinch hitter in the second? That's weird. Did somebody get hurt? Holy crap! We're coming in in the second because Colorado is up 5-0 to zero on our team. We did have a 5-4 record. We might go to five, drop to 500 at this rate. <laughs> Thanks a lot, manager. Was this supposed to be my day off? And we're getting killed? And they're like, well, you're getting killed. Put Tug Dick out there. Let the other guy rest. Oh, Tug Dick's got to play well anyway, because Angel Pagan is... um. He's on the bench, and he's a decent player. Oh, we're down six to zero. <laughs> great, absolutely great. Nolan Arenado will stride in again. Hey Nolan, how about you, Sing Nolan? Hit him. that didn't work. It didn't work. Fastball. Right, let's take a step back. It's a beautiful oh, day right for baseballs. Really You're out, son. Field. Oh, wait, I'm 42. That wasn't showing me strikeout earlier. Get off my baseball field. Wait, who's starter? Oh, they must have pulled the uh, giant starter. Oh, I wonder if they did a double... No, they didn't do a double switch, because I would be hitting lower down in the lineup then. Alright, guy on second. Bottom of the fourth, we need six runs to tie. At least there are no outs. Man, this guy's got a lot of pitches. Yeah, you know you're scared of Tug Dick. You're afraid to give him something to hit. Oh. Damn it, you twat! Mary twat, miss, I hate you! Tug Dick, settle down. You're too angry. Oh, change up. I hate it. If the Emperor was here, he'd be very happy at all the anger and hate that's being spawned right now. You and your damn curveballs. I don't know if you've given me one fastball. If you did, they were all super high. Now another one, two. And he lays off a pitch outside as they draw yeah, that's not Tug Dick's pitch. Some of the other ones that are outside are, but not that one. 
Go to third, go to third! Hey, he advanced the runner! It was the dumbest way possible, just swinging enough to the catcher drops it, or catcher didn't drop it, it was in the dirt. But still, it advanced the runner. He kind of did his job. Somebody get that runner home. No. God dang it, Giants! Don't make me back all the Oakland fans that have been watching and been like, Boo Giants! Yeah, you got hit by pitch, man. Keep leaning out over the plate. You know what's a good game? This is the pitcher coming up to bat for the Rockies. Odds are he's going to hit this pretty hard. It's a bad game if the pitcher's rocking you. At the plate. Oh no! It's a grounder. Which nobody could get. Come on, run over there and cleat the pitcher. It'll help the team out. Their pitcher has <laughs> almost as many hits as our team has. Our team has two hits, their pitcher has at least one hit. Hey DJ, play me some rad tunes on your turntable. With your microphones. Your microbones, because you got a tiny wiener! <laughs> Tug Dick Smack says the nicest man. Now, and this should give him at least two bases. Nobody's getting home. Where the hell are you throwing that dude? I think you're throwing it to their guy who was on deck. You're not the pitcher cutoff man. You gotta throw it to the catcher. This pitch is bell high and he just jumps all over it and drives it into the alley to put runners on second and third now. Remember when we played Arizona in the beginning of the year? And I'm like, we're unstoppable! And then, like, here, week two, where I'm like, maybe we're stoppable! <laughs> it's still super early. Oh, God, the... Rockies are murdering us. Tigers did that to the uh, Twins earlier this year. It was, like, second or third game of the year. All right, 0 for 1 with a strikeout. All I need is one hit, and I'll have one-third of the hits on the team. Come on, up the middle, up the middle, yeah! Chuck Dick in the house. How do you like that? 42, we're wearing the same numbers. You're like my bizarro alternative. Buster Posey. Quit uh, playing with your wood, dude. I'm pretty sure they're chanting MVP for him and not for Tug Dick. Oh, damn it, Buster Posey. That's hilarious. Buster Posey comes to the plate and the fans are like, MVP, MVP, and then he hits into a double play. Oh. Still, Tug Dick has one third of the hits for the team, which doesn't mean a hell of a lot, but yeah. Your hey, Juan Budieras. 7.71 ERA. God, that's got to come down. We're getting our butts spanked. Makes me almost want to cry. See, I think Colorado came in thought they were playing a football game. They thought they were the Denver Broncos. And we thought we were some sort of hockey team. Now here's the pitch. And good contact there as this is hit. All right, fielder, please catch that. And the eighth will start with a bang as this should be extra bases. I can't see what's going on. I want to look at the wall out there. The wall's really cool. Oh, we're wearing 42 in um, honor of... Um, Oh, who's that? Reggie Jackson? That's why everyone's got 42 on. They were looking for the hidden ball trick there, and I'll tell you what, it just about worked. I never even noticed that. Look at all the 42s there. I'm super observant, as you can see. And absorbent. If you spill something, put me in it. I'll suck it right... Uh, I'm not going to finish that sentence. Fuck you, manager. I'm not going to go deep. 
I'm losing nine eight. I'm going wherever the fuck I want. Tug Dick's got a good attitude like that. Kicks and deals. There's a drive high in the air and deep to left center field. And this is turning ugly now. Out of my way. How do I know who I am when everybody's wearing the same number? God, Colorado is rude. Oh, are you going to pull someone now? I think you blame the manager right there. When he left a guy in to give up five runs in the first inning. Our hitting's been pretty crap, too, this game, though. Hey, Justin Morneau! Can you guys quit hitting? You're embarrassing our whole team! We don't look like giants out here, we look like little tiny people. Morno waits the one one. Lily Pucians. Now a swing and an easy fly ball that toward right center. You're out. Reaches up to track this one Come on, right fielder, why don't you do something out there? That was your territory, bro. She just wanted to watch some tug dick action. Tug dick will be tasked now with leading, leading things off in their half of the, the night. Of the night. Try to do something to prevent being shut out. Tug. And whatever they've done for the first eight innings hasn't yielded a whole lot so far, so quite frankly... All right, Tug Dick. Man, this guy's going to get a complete game shutout against us. That'll be two games in a row. And this will be fouled away. I think where the Rockies shut us out for a win. Wait, what was that? Okay, it was a four-seam fastball. Ah! You like the way this guy is just going about his business here. He's got a big lead, but he's pitching like that was a perfect swing and a perfect pitch. Keep going, Tug Dick. God, this whole game was horrible. Saddest thing is Tug Dick was one of the better hitters in the game. And he came in in the second inning. This has been another very good performance. Good enough to most likely keep that winning streak going. Uh, can we at least break the shutout? No. We lose 10 to 0. We lose by a field goal and the touchdown. Great. Manager, why are you talking to me? Go talk to the rest of the team. My guy was one for three. Tug Dick had one quarter of the hits on the team. Yeah, guys, you can't win if you can't score, so there's probably not a whole lot of debate about we'll take Two games in a row <laughs> where we got shut out, I think, in complete games by the other pitcher. Either the Rockies have amazing pitching this year, or our team can't hit worth a crap right now. Oh, there's the double play Buster Posey hit into. Well, everybody, thanks for watching the Tug Dick Show. I will see you all next time, hopefully when we play someone else and win.